Well, guess what? I got cut off again. I did 12 minutes and it got cut off and everything that I did, it's not there. So I'm just really ticked off. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to try to re-step through everything. Let me turn this TV noise off. Okay. This is going to be hard because I, I just can't believe this happened. It just, anyway. So you, I think you saw the stuff from Linda. And you saw the hats from Linda. So those those two things was done. Then I got a box from Cindy King. And she sent a whole bunch of hats. And I'm just going to show you the hats because I've been through this once. But the hats are absolutely gorgeous. I And I even showed, and look at this hat. I had even tried this on. So you could see how it, well, I, I mean, what how you could wear this hat. And then I said, and then I pulled it down and I said, this way I could go incognito, incognito. No one would recognize me in, in Walmart. I could go and sneak in and sneak out and they would never know who I am. <laughs> or you could push it up, up above your ears and wear it any way you want. I said, a gorgeous hat. I just love it. And she said... Uh, I showed you that one. Okay, now these three hats she sent. But look at the difference. And see how this looks same same yarn, and then there's this one and this one. Aren't they beautiful? But it just shows you the different. See how that just the pattern of the yarn. Yeah, it's just it's just gorgeous. And she sent. Uh, oh, I love this one too. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that pretty? I love, I just loved it. I still love it. I loved it even more the first time, but now I love it even more than that. And then the soft little yellow beanie hat. Very nice. And I love this one too. Almost looks like a crown. Isn't that pretty with all the bubble, sti bubble stitches in it? And it has, the, and you could turn this, oh, she's got it tacked up. But anyway, that turns up like that. But isn't that pretty? Uh, they're gorgeous, honey. Just gorgeous. Now, if I get screwed up here on what came with what, I apologize. I can't believe that it stopped on me. I should have known that that the way that they, um, the timing on it was wrong when I did it. Okay, then I got, okay, so that was from Linda. You saw what I, I mean, you saw what I got from Linda. And you saw what I got from Cindy. Now, Cindy also sent me this. She knew, I read the card, she knew about how much I adored Princess Diana. And she found this at a yard sale, but look at this. Oops, oops. Isn't she, isn't she gorgeous? Look at that. And she sent me a stand to put it on. And I'm going to display that. Isn't that gorgeous? I just loved it. This is a limited edition plate, and it's a tribute to Princess Diana from the Franklin Mint, and it's fine porcelain, and it even has the plate number 5B4311. But isn't that gorgeous? Very pretty. I love it. I just love it. Thank you so much. And i put that over there for it be safe. And was a card and then um, I hope I get all this right I apologize I just so apologize um, for this thing cutting out on the other one was I got a box from Petra for Foxy Creations and she sent me a whole bag of cotton yarn peaches and cream Lots of pieces. I was so excited. I'm telling you, you should have seen. I even had tears. It just, this whole thing, just all these wonderful gifts. And some sachet, sachet yarns, which I could make some dresses with for my dolls. And she sent me, I already put some of this away. She sent me a beautiful fan. Or somebody sent me a fan. I think it was Petra. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? It's like my other fan. So I have one in here and one in the living room. 
And then she sent me all kinds of beautiful things. All kinds of, um, uh, whoops, this one keeps losing its balls. All kinds of um, beads and alphabet. Here for the alphabet. Now this, this, you know what, alphabet. Uh -huh. Let's see, H hook, G hook. I'm going to use this. You watch what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to put this on. I'm going to put these on a, yes, I'm going to, you, you wait and see. I'll show you what I'm going to do with those. She sent me buttons. Oh, and also, I think these are from, I think these are from Linda. She sent me these buttons. And I also got, I got no frogging button. And I got these two buttons. Peenies, peenies, and the penis button, the penis button, penis, <laughs> flower button, <laughs> I mean flower button, <laughs> how many, <laughs> oh my god, I'm losing my mind, okay, you know what kind of flower it is, okay, I got some white buttons, she sent me white buttons, black buttons, red buttons, I got some buttons, and she sent me lots of fur, uh, fun fur to work with and she sent me all kinds of sequins for making things with and red buttons I told you red oh and she sent me these beads here for making necklaces or bracelets or whatever for my dolls and um, here's some white buttons oh gosh she's just oh she sent me all kinds of stuff okay a lot of sequins and stuff like that and let's see, you saw the yarn she sent me. Um, and this you saw. Oh, I got a, a little cupcake. Which I'm going to make a hat for the, for the kids. And you saw all the hats. You saw, I'm sure you saw those hats, these hats. Okay. So you saw all the hats. We got some hats. And all my, all this stuff. And then I showed you at the end, I showed you, I made this, oh, oh he's losing something. This is, um, I decided last night, I took one, two, three of these squares that you sent, and I'm making a hobo bag for myself. Yep. And I think now I'm going to make, take, I found, I found another one of these, which is these two here. And this one, I'm going to crochet a different color and put it here and use it as a flap. You know, so it'll come down, you know, square. And it'll come down and, you know, probably come down like that. But anyway, so I'm going to make this. I'm going to make that. But this is the lining. I cut this out. Now I'm kind of sorry I did because I wasn't going to make. But I can I can work with it. So I've sewed the sides. And all I have to do is i got to sew in, uh, sew in the lining. And uh, make the um, handles for it. So that's a little project I was working on last night. And it, it came out pretty good. You can find these, the tutorials on. Now, I didn't follow any. I just saw the idea was from a tutorial. But the uh, outline, you know, the colors and the outline I did myself. So, And I love, you know, I'm, I love um, the look of a front post. This is double front post crochet stitch that I put on there and it gives it see it gives it a little depth I mean it gives it some kind of a I don't know I just don't like straight stitching but I like that so yes yeah, so I made that last night and now I've got to decide what color I want to put around this to, to add to the top so that's what I was working on last night making myself a hobo bag plus then I'm going to take all four colors put them together and do the, um, you didn't even see, I, I am so sorry that this thing cut out on me again. It just, that irritates me to death. And I know that, oh, I got this little bag here. Look at this. Look at the donut. It's donuts. Isn't that cool? And it's got the pink, pink, uh, green lining with a pink zipper. And I think this was from Linda the box bottom that cute so cute 
Hmm. So, I don't know what to say. It was a beautiful, beautiful, <laughs> it was a great video. I just am just taken back by it got cut off again. I've just got to learn and it's very, these things are very sensitive. And I must have laid a card up here or something and it stopped it. I'm just an old lady. You have to forgive me. Please forgive me those that you sent. I mean, I was just so excited. It's hard to, you know, to, anyway, you understand. You guys are good. I love you. I love everything. I love all the hats. I love all the gifts that you sent me, the yarn. I just see things that I can make with it. And I think some of the charisma yarn, I might have another one in here somewhere um, to match up. That would be two and maybe make, you know, a scarf and a hat to go for the kids. So yeah, there's a lots of, lots of neat stuff. And I, I just thank you so much, especially for my plate, for all my little, uh, crafty things to do. Oh, it's just it's beautiful. Oh, Chiquita. This little set that you sent. Chiquita, hope you're listening. This little set that you sent. Uh, somebody would like to know if it's a pattern, if you have a pattern for this. Will you let me know if there is or if this was just one of your wonderful creative ideas? But if there's a pattern for, for this, can you um, send it to me so that I can relay it on to other? I'll do it in the community so that people will know that this is this pattern. But I did get lots of questions about this. So let's, Chiquita, Miss Deborah. She's a wonderful lady. Y'all have to go on and check out her stuff. But look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? So anyway, so if you... Um, if you do have a pattern, please send me so that I can send it to other people. And the other pattern um, that was very popular was the Ruby Stedman, the, the hats that that swirled. Boy, I got a lot of requests for that. And I did send the, the information on that Charlotte sent me. So thank you so much. I appreciate that. There was something I was supposed to say to somebody. I can't remember the somebody that told me the somebody to send to somebody. And, and I don't even remember the message that I was got from somebody to send to somebody about something, somebody. Did y'all get that? I didn't. But anyway, so I will um, get this posted. I'm so sorry. Guys, I am just so sorry. And I read your cards and everything. I just I just mentally can't. It was hard for me to, to go through all that. I mean, to go through that again. But, you know, I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. I just want to thank you so much. I just, everything was just wonderful. I'm just, it's beside myself. I, I'm just beside myself. I also got a note from the uh, foundation, uh, the Kids in Need Foundation. She sent me a little note, and I will try to um, post that. And uh, it's also, uh, if I knew if anybody, anybody else that wanted to, you know, do stuff. Anyway, um, I'm rambling, and I don't know what. I'm just so disappointed that I lost 45 minutes of my 45 minutes. I was up to a yes, and and I forgot to tell you that Cheryl, Cheryl sent me two books, A to Z Crochet, which I noticed a lot of people have, and it's I love it. And the other one she sent me was the Crochet Closet. This was all on Thrift Books. She sent me, and they have some beautiful patterns in it. They're all crochet. They look like they're all sweaters, vests. Uh, jackets and look at this one this is the one I'm I'm gonna make isn't that gorgeous this is done in a bulky weight to a number five and it says here I guess the sizes are in brackets so bulky weight five so the skeins that you would need um, 
Well, I'm not sure, but it's it'll take a lot of skeins. <laughs> like if you wanted to make a, it doesn't, this doesn't make sense. It puts nine skeins and that's in brackets. Oh, maybe. Oh, okay. Instructions are written for size extra small with size small, medium, and large in set of the brackets. I guess if I would read, that would come through. But anyway, you would need at least to do a medium and large, 10 to 12 at least, 10 to 12 balls. But I, I love that. I just love that. That is so beautiful. That is just so beautiful. And it's a bulky weight. You can always wear it. Somebody, whoever owned this before, had this marked. Oh. Yeah, they did. They had this one marked. Isn't that pretty? Can you see it? The bell sleeves. That's a cute little jacket, too. That Like she has it. She has it on with black, and this is done with a four. And what I like is they give you the sizes, then in the brackets they tell you uh, how many centimeters or, you know, the inches across that you would need and all that good stuff. Oh, it's beautiful. This is easy. That would be easy, easy peasy. I have to make that too. Yeah, they're, they're, they're really so pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Some gorgeous, gorgeous. Look at this jacket. Oops, isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. Now, some of them don't. I don't like the yarn that they used for it, but this could be a cute, a cute little jacket. I don't like that yarn, but it would look cute with any yarn. And this is a, this is made with um, a four. Bouchelet cardin. Best Bouchelet cardin. I just love that long jacket. There's some cute stuff in here. Wait a minute. Let me show you this jacket. And then we'll say goodbye. And I'll get this posted. I am so sorry. But isn't that cute? Toot toot. Very cute. Well, all I can say is I deeply apologize to, every, to everyone for losing losing 45 minutes of my previous video this is tape two of the mail i'm so sorry all the hats god bless you keep on hooking and i'm going to go throw a few things what is it kick the cat kick the can kick the cat kick the cat throw a few things um and then i'll go in and eat lunch and, um, but I won't overeat. I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't, I never overeat. I just, I got two spoons and I'm just going to have to, with this frustration and the stress of this, I just lost a spoon. So now I'm down to one spoon. That's it for the day. One spoon. Can you believe that? Oh God, I hate being under stress, but thank you guys for everything. You know who you are. Petra, Linda. Cindy, Cheryl, thank you so much for everything. Everything was absolutely wonderful. And uh, Cindy, you did a great job on the hats. They're beautiful. They'll match anybody's hats. So don't think that your hats aren't as good as anybody else's because they are. They are just as good. They're beautiful. They're going to keep a child warm this winter. And... God is going to bless you, all of you, for all that you've done for these kids. Well, I'm going to say goodbye um, and get this posted. And um, y'all keep hooking. And I got to go kick the cat and throw a few things off, off the wall. I just I can't believe it. Oh, well. That's life. You have to take the good with the bad, right? And I don't know if I told you on the other one, but I did get an appointment for June 20th with my with my oncologist to talk about the um, hematomas in the eyes. The, I had a, another bloody nose last night and had one today. So we need to address this and find out what's going on.
So my lovies, my lovies, my lovies, <laughs> my happy hookers, um, bid you good do and uh, keep hooking, okay? And I will see you next mail day. Bye.